what's good y'all welcome back to my channel it's been a while since i said that because i've been doing vlogs lately honestly it's been a while since it's been a sit down video in general and not only that it's been a while since it's been a makeup video so in today's video i'm going to show you guys all the new goodies that i have bought recently and or have been keeping for this video in a way it is a haul of stuff that i've been accumulating and buying so if you guys want to have fun and just look at makeup and brand new stuff and see what's out there what i've gotten then keep on watching but first if you love a channel full of different and spontaneous content then follow me along my journey and click the subscribe button down below as well as that little notification bell to have you guys notify when i do upload as always i do work a lot so i am trying to keep up with my scheduling and still keep posting for you guys because i generally do love doing this as a hobby but without further ado let's get on to the video so i've already primed my skin and did my brows i do have a product to show you for brows i would say this is more of a drugstore makeup haul for today's video the first product i do want to show you is for my brows like i said i already did my brows but i did find this nyx professional makeup tinted brow mascara it's for your brows it's like a brow gel but i did find this you guys at walmart for 99 cents literally 99 cents i think the original price is like four or five bucks so i did save myself some money and i actually do really like it a lot it sets my brows really really nice and i have a lot of brushes for today's videos and sponges that i also got on clearance also at walmart by the way i did use the profusion x mean girl cosmetics brush the eyebrow brush it's more of a tinier brush but i love it it did a good job of filling my brows you guys will never guess how much this brush set was i will give you guys a few seconds it was literally only like 568 i believe six dollars less than six dollars for all these brushes it has like a powder brush a contour brush an eye brush and a thinner eye brush kind of like i would use this for like cut creases or to set my cut crease and then an eyebrow brush so i did use the eyebrow brush like i said i am going to be using this throughout the whole video the quality of the brush by the way compares a lot to the quality of the wet and wild ones which if you guys have not tried the wet and wild brushes what are you doing because they're literally one of the affordable brushes you can get for the drugstore that literally compared to high-end brushes quality is so good for it to be six dollars so next i do have a new sponge that i've been wanting to try mainly because it's maroon and black i have not owned a black sponge and again i saw it on clearance at walmart there's a lot of good clearance stuff at walmart right now so it's made by this brand i do not want to butcher it the original price was 12.98 and i found this bad boy for 4.93 but off the bat they feel so super super bouncy so i'm having a good feeling of these sponges one more shot, one more also i do want to say i don't have anything new for foundations or concealers or bronzer but i do want to show you guys this cute little mirror by metamorphosis and i'm filming i can't sit on my vanity because my vanity is facing this way and i put you guys on the camera obviously this way so when i'm filming videos for you guys i have to have like a mirror for me to kind of look at but i got the super lightweight mirror and again it's from metamorphosis it's so freaking cute you guys light enough for me to not get tired as i'm filming As I'm letting my concealer dry a bit, I am going to show you guys some other brushes that I did get. I would say these are more so for blending out your foundation or concealer, more of like cream stuff. And these normally are for like eight or nine bucks. I also did get one of these. I got a NYX foundation brush, you guys. It's normally $14.97 and I did get this for $4.34. So I am going to use one of these brushes. I do not know which one yet. After I blend everything out with my sponge, I do like going over it with a brush just to make sure everything is blended out. Bonnie and Clyde You can have whatever you like When it's you and I We can have the one I believe these are the last brushes that I have for you guys But these are so freaking cute I'm kind of upset at myself that I didn't get more of these And again, I found these on clearance uh, The powder brush was $3.49 The original price was $4.98 And then the smaller kind of highlighter brush 
I did find for $374, which was also $498. Like I said already, I'm the biggest fan of Wet n Wild brushes because they're just literally the bang of your buck. I want to show you guys what a regular Wet n Wild brush looks like. Pink on top, white, and this is what these look like. I can't believe I found these. These have the One Wild logo, but they have glitter, you guys. They're so adorable. I wish, like I said, I would have gotten more of these. I was so dumb to not get more. Alright, the next new product that I did get is the Power Puff Girls X Color Pop Blush. And this blush is in Saving the World. Looking at it online, I thought it was super, super cute. But when I did look at it in person and I did receive it, I felt like it was definitely way more lighter than the picture. So hopefully it shows up on my face. Are you the same? I am definitely glad it did show up on my face. I had to tone it down a little bit because I got overhand. The next thing I did purchase was this Metamorphosis Highlighter. Super, super, super tiny. It's so cute. So affordable as well. And it has a little bare imprint, you guys. This highlighter is absolutely stunning. And it's blinding. We love supporting small businesses and businesses that has good quality products. Same. I have two very exciting palettes that I did get. Um, they've been out for a few weeks, by the way. I did purchase the Power Puff Girl by ColourPop. This palette is absolutely stunning, you guys. Look at how beautiful it is. I love the baby blue. I love that the fact that they added them on there. I love the colors, um, the shimmers, the mattes. And I also bought the Bratz X Revolution Makeup Revolution. This makes me um, regret me not saving my Bratz because I definitely remember playing with my Bratz dolls and they were my favorite. It looks like this actual packaging it's metal not to mention it's a huge palette so definitely way on the opposite scale of the other palette that i showed you guys what i do love about both is that they both come with mirrors it's so awesome this has a ginormous mirror you guys look at this but it also has stunning colors and i hope that they transfer well onto my lid because that would be such a disappointment Today I was feeling a halo. I really did like the shadows, you guys, for both palettes. I'm not complaining. They are very, very pigmented, which I love. I do have a new mascara, and this mascara is by e.l.f. I think it just recently launched. It's called the e.l.f. Big Mood Mega Volume Lifting Mascara, and it has the hourglass brush it looks like this and it was literally only seven dollars you guys i personally do not mind the hourglass i do love hourglass i feel like mascara is just a more uh, personal preferen preference i feel like everyone just likes something different but i personally do not mind the hourglass i don't know if you guys can pick it up on camera it's purple has the elf logo on there it's cute it is kind of more bigger but it's super lightweight i'm gonna go ahead and apply the mascara first and then we're gonna go on to some false lashes
Pero me duele si respiro El problema no es que hoy ya no haya nada Sino la verdad que nunca pude Oh no, as you can see I got some on me Um, it definitely is big brush But I like the way it coat my lashes It did not get them clumpy whatsoever And it definitely did give them volume I am gonna take this off quick So if you have small eyes then it's probably gonna be more difficult And I did notice that a lot of the product did accumulate towards the end of the brush Again, yeah, it was literally only like $7 so I definitely did like it for $7 It definitely did something So earlier on in the video I did show you the Pro Profusion X Mean Gross collection. They did launch their eyelashes, four pairs of eyelashes for $10. You guys know that some brands charge these mofos for $30 to $40. So the fact that these are $10, I mean, come on now. They are literally gorgeous. Very, very affordable. It does come with the glue, by the way. I am not gonna use the glue. And I had to stock up on none other than my favorite lash brand so i did have to stock up on my favorite style which is bebecita she also did repackage her lashes i mean look at how beautiful it is it has butterflies on there and look at it it's so cute this is in the style of bebecita again my favorite i always stock up on this and this is her newer lash in the style hot girl I also love this style. I've already used it once. I think this is this is probably the one that I'm gonna go for today. After like 10 years, I am finally back. Last but not least, you guys, for lips, I am using um the Bratz X Revolution Jade Lip Crayon. It looks absolutely stunning. I can't wait to try it. I do regret not getting the other shades. Eterno, tus besos fríos como el invierno. I'm gonna top it up with lip gloss and this is by again metamorphosis this is a luxury lip gloss in the shade iris and I did get the shade iris because I do have my lovely cousin slash comadre I love her so much um, so this made me think of her Again, it's in the shade Iris Gloss. It's a glossy nude, and it literally reminds me of her because she does like her nudes. And this is the completed look, you guys. We have officially made it to the end of the video. I do have to say I don't have a product that I dislike. I liked them all. I'm so glad that my money's worth was spent on really, really good products. I would have to choose my favorite product. I would probably go for the two palettes. It performed really, really well. And who doesn't love new eyeshadow? And with that being said, I hope you guys have a beautiful, wonderful, fabulous night or day wherever you guys are located. And I will see you guys on my next video. Bye guys. Peace. <laughs>